Hi viewers, welcome to Ella's Eat Bits. Today I have a very special episode for you. I'm here meeting my father, a very eminent person and the son of a very prominent person, a luminary in the society, uh, Professor Shottin Bosch. I guess those who have studied physics, those who know physics, surely know about this name, right? He is very well known for his boson uh, that he did with boson. What was that, Baba? Bose-Einstein. Uh, Bo Bose and Einstein statistics with Einstein and Shukten Bosch. And his younger son, Roman Bosch, who happens to be my father. So welcome to the channel today. Hi, kids. <laughs> I'm so happy that you came here. Thank you, Baba. Yeah, okay. Uh, together. Baba, we are connected because of Ma, the very prominent lady in your life and all those who knew her in our lives. So meet Randy Ellie Lautrop. She came all the way from Denmark many, many years ago. And she happened because of this man and everything around us happened, right? Vegetarian, both of us know that. Um, her first non-veg step was into eggs. She started off with eggs. But what is your favorite dish that Ma used to make for you? Mashed potato. There is no doubt about it. So as you already heard from my father, he loved having uh, mashed potatoes made by my mother. I'm trying it her way. Um, in Mandrita's kitchen here in Newtown, these are some of her pets. I've already shared with you the hamster babies that she has. One of her hamsters has given birth to five little pups last evening. And this special episode is for my mother. It's her birthday, 1st of October. And... Mashed potatoes. I have some peeled potatoes and some water in the pressure cooker. One whistle and it will be done. As a side dish, I'm going to put some vegetables. So I have some carrots here, cauliflower, um, bell peppers and some baby corn. I'm going to use some chili flakes and some pizza seasoning. You can also use oregano if you want. This is absolutely optional. Don't worry about it. The olive oil, that is one tablespoon. Olive oil is getting heated in the pan. I'm going to add the vegetables and saute them. For the mashed potatoes, I have some chopped parsley, some milk, some butter and some pepper and salt. As the butter melts, I'm going to add the salt and pepper. The milk goes in. I'll bring it to boil and then add the mashed potatoes. I'll mix it well to bring in that fluffiness and let it mix and combine well. The more uh, it... Um, the more you mix it, the more fluffy it becomes. And this is the carb part of your uh, meal today. And there go in the parsley leaves just to add a little color and a little flavor to it. The mashed potatoes are also ready. Now let's concentrate on the protein part of it. I have some palm fruit. I'm going to make this into uh, fish in sour cream. Homemade cream. You don't have to go and buy anything extra for it. It's everything that you have in the fridge, I'm sure. So on a high flame, I will toss the fishes on both sides. Put it on the side. Uh, in the same oil, I will add the curd that I have beaten well. To this go in the um, maida or one teaspoon of all-purpose flour. And then a bowl of milk the salt and pepper you can add some chili flakes if you want i will add half a tablespoon of lemon juice to bring in the sourness the cream is going to the milk is going to make it creamy so sour cream is ready wait till the end of the video i'll share some pictures of my mother and me a regret I will always have is my mother never got to see little Ella but somehow I believe she traveled all the way in her, Ella's little heart to be with us for those eight months. Love you Ella and love you my mom.
One evening when I caught her waiting for me, her little garden of roses that she loved so much, the happy peck on the cheek because I reached on time, the joyous frame of Baba Ma and me, ready to go shopping, she and me. As she sat making some beler sorbot or wood apple juice that was waiting for our pizzas at the shop. Wasn't that mashed potatoes fluffy and yum looking? I'm sure it was. Definitely try it out. A lovely recipe, a tasty one. It can go with some bread if you want. And please in the comment box below, leave a, kind, a comment telling me what is your favorite way of eating potatoes, right? If you're a newcomer, do subscribe to the channel. Thank you for all the love shared. Thank you for the care, for the time you spend with us. Looking forward to see you again.